Are you a new mom looking to master the art of cleaning your breastfeeding pump in minutes? Well, look no further. In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly and efficiently clean your breast pump so that it's ready for use again. 1. How often should I clean my breastfeeding pump? Cleaning your breast pump after each use is the best way to protect yourself and your baby from any risk of contamination. It is important to thoroughly clean your pump parts in between pumping sessions, as this will help keep the milk free from bacteria or viruses that can cause infection. 2. What type of cleaner is best for cleaning a breast pump? It's important to use the right cleaning products when it comes to maintaining and sanitizing your breast pump. The most recommended cleaner for breast pumps is a hospital-grade non-alcoholic, pH-neutral cleanser that is specifically designed for use on medical equipment. You can find these cleaners in baby supply stores or online. You should avoid using detergents, soaps, or other harsh cleaners that may leave residue behind, as they may damage the equipment or even harm your baby if transferred through milk. Additionally, make sure not to submerge the motor of a battery-operated or electric pump in water. When cleaning all components of your breast pump tubing, bottles, seals, etc., ensure you rinse them off thoroughly with warm water. If you need to scrub them down, use a soft brush or cloth and scrub gently. Avoid using scourers as they can scratch the surface of your pump and leave it open to bacteria growth. Finally, always ensure all components are completely dry before storing them away. 3. Is it safe to use soap and hot water to clean the breast pump parts? Yes, it is safe to use soap and hot water to clean the breast pump parts. Make sure you use a mild, non-antibacterial dishwashing liquid that won't leave any residue on the plastic parts of the pump. Additionally, be sure to rinse all of the parts thoroughly with warm water after washing them in order to remove any soap residue. If you're using a bottle brush for cleaning bottles or other small items, Make sure it's one designed for this purpose and not used for general household cleaning. Finally, dry all components before reassembling your breast pump. This will help prevent bacteria from growing on damp surfaces. Taking these steps will ensure that your breast pump is always clean and ready for use. 4. Should I wash each part of the breast pump separately or together? It is important to wash each part of the breast pump separately. This will help you ensure proper cleaning and disinfecting for each component. As some components may require a different method of cleaning or may need to be cleaned more thoroughly than others. Additionally, certain parts of the pump must be completely dry before being used again. When washing each part separately, make sure to use warm soapy water and scrub gently with a clean cloth or sponge. Rinse the parts thoroughly under running water before air drying them on a clean surface. For extra hygiene, consider using a dishwasher safe container to soak your pump's accessories in hot soapy water after every use. After washing and drying, be sure to store all components together in a clean, dry location. 5. Do I need any special tools or equipment to help me with cleaning my breast pump? Absolutely. To ensure thorough and efficient cleaning of your breast pump, you will need the following. Bottle brush, dish soap, a clean cloth or paper towel, bleach solution 3 teaspoons 15 milliliters per quart liter, distilled water, and an appropriate storage container. Additionally, it is important to get into the habit of replacing tubing on a regular basis. This should be done every few months as well as after any illness. 6. How long does it take to fully sanitize a breast pump using this method? Sanitizing your breast pump using the boiling method should take no more than 15 minutes. It is important to ensure that all parts of the breast pump are submerged in the water and boiled for at least 5 to 10 minutes. After this time, you can then remove the breast pump pieces from the boiling water and carefully dry them off with a clean cloth or paper towel. This technique is proven to be an effective way of cleaning and sanitizing breast pumps, as it kills any potential bacteria and viruses on the surface. You should also consider sterilizing all of your pumping accessories every two to three months to maximize hygiene standards. 7. 
Are there any safety concerns that should be kept in mind while cleaning a breastfeeding pump? Yes, safety should always be kept in mind when cleaning a breastfeeding pump. It is important to ensure that all materials used are sterilized and that the equipment comes into contact with only clean water. It is also important to avoid submerging the motor of the pump underwater to prevent any electrical hazards or damage by liquids. Additionally, it is best practice to unplug the power source before disassembling and cleaning any parts of your breast pump. Lastly, after each use, inspect all parts for signs of wear or damage before reassembling and storing your breast pump safely away from children and pets. Following these steps will help ensure a safe and successful cleaning experience every time. We hope this video has given you some useful tips on how to master breastfeeding pump cleaning in minutes. Cleaning your breast pumps regularly is an essential part of keeping them safe and hygienic for both yourself and your baby. Remember, the key points are, one, disassemble all parts, two, wash with warm soapy water, three, rinse thoroughly, four, sanitize every 24 hours, five, air dry completely before reassembling. If you have any questions or would like more information about breastfeeding pump cleaning, please leave a comment below. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed our video and subscribe to our channel for more helpful videos like this one.